Welcome back. Second day of fall and it is time for apple picking season. In Western North Carolina, farmers say the next couple of months will make or break their orchards as more people move and visit Henderson County. These farms are seeing a tourism boom. Peyton Furtado explains why. Business is bobbing. Apples are flying off the trees and shelves. And David Carland is one of several Apple Alley farmers at the core of it all. His farm stand at Mountain Fresh Orchard is just open the end of August through the beginning of November. That's our make it or break it right there. He says in 36 years, he hasn't seen business like this. I don't know what it was about COVID, but it really opened up our business uh, substantially because I think people couldn't do anything else, so they came to the farm. Agritourism brings in about $90 million to Henderson County's economy every year. So it's no wonder area farmers have long cashed their crops in on fall traditions. The restaurants benefit, the gas stations, Walmart even. By themselves, apples account for 30 to $35 million of Henderson County's income. Some of this year's crop was damaged by late freezes, leading to lighter harvests. I mean, we had 17 days after March the 1st, uh, from March the 1st to about the middle of April that were below 32 degrees. And that's just not the kind of weather we need during the, the time when they're blooming and setting fruit. But Carlin says the weather hasn't taken a bite out of business. In fact, as more people move to the region, How are you all today? Good, thanks. Business is steady round the clock. If I get a chance to talk to them, I try to find, always find out where they're from. And a lot of them, uh, they're living here locally, but they're from all over the United States. We even have some from, you know, all around the world. The county's nearly 30 farm stands and orchards growing area tourism, economy, and even population, keeping Apple Alley busy through November. And uh, we're about wore out by then. <laughs>